Hello dear colleagues and welcome to your channel. In this video, I'm going to shortly teach uh, the easiest way to draw grid lines in ETABS. As you know, there are a lot of uh, ways to do that, but I'm going to uh, teach the easiest way. You know, the first way, uh, the first usual way is uh, to right click on the plan view, you know, and add or modify grid, modify. And here we can add some grid, you know, in X direction or Y direction is the, it is the first way. Let me delete that. The second way is draw develop, uh, develop definition uh, lines. You know, suppose that here I'm going to do that from draw menu and draw developed elevation definition. You know, for example, elevation bond. I'm going to OK that. I click on this grid line, this, this and this and then I right click that it's the first elevation you know but uh, the easiest way that is my discuss in this video is to do here do that you know uh, I click uh, on the grid on the grid where I want it for example here I choose this point of lines of columns I select four point you know four column point and from edit menu add grid line add grid lines at selected joints and I'm gonna name that G1 it asks me do you want to parallel to X or parallel to Y I want that to be parallel to X I mean the horizontal direction and I apply that you know let me check that let's continue I uh, select another we can't see them because we didn't complete the y direction I'm going to continue from edit menu add grid lines as selected okay and these three edit add grid lines okay now I'm gonna make the direction of Y add grid lines and I'm gonna choose the parallel to Y you know now you can see that these are our lines you know I select in y direction as you can see edit edit sorry I repeat that edit add grid lines add selected its name is 2 again edit Add grid lines okay and we repeat this stage edit add grid lines at selected these are our grid lines uh, now we can see them because we complete uh, both X and Y direction now we can modify them from this you know these are our grid lines that we have created them now we can uh, trim them or correct them as we want it now our tutorial is over i hope you all enjoy it and if you like it please subscribe to the channel to motivate me to create more videos for you thank you